Hello and welcome to my tutorial on how to use Mixamo with the B style characters that come with Smile Game Builder. So what you need to do first is go ahead and export a model that you want to use. Um, I went ahead and exported the Hero 1B. I'm just using export and putting it in a folder. So you'll see it here. This is how it exports it. So next you'll need to open up Blender come into here and import the FBX file. So find your FBX file and import it. Then you'll want to zoom in and just grab the, uh, actually just grab the, um, the model here, right click on it. You'll hit Alt P, clear and keep transform. So it's going to clear the parent, but it's still going to keep the transform on the object. Then we'll delete the bones. And what we're going to do is export this as an FBX file. So we'll just go back and save over uh, the exported model. Next, we need to import into Mixamo. I'm keeping the empties here because we're going to use those once we um, have the Mixamo bones on there. So don't delete those. So I'm going to go to Mixamo. So let's go to Mixamo, which is Mixamo.com. You do have to have an Adobe account to use this. It's free, so you can sign up for one if you need one. What we're going to do is upload the character, select character file, so we're going to import the Hero 1B and it's going to import pretty quickly here. All right. So it's already imported. We'll hit next. Now we have to set up where the parts of the body are. So here's the chin. The wrists are right there. The elbows are right about there maybe a little bit yeah and then the knees are right about here and the groin is right about there once that's done you'll want to choose a um a mat or a skeleton so the skeleton that we want to choose is probably this 25 bone one you don't need one with fingers or anything like that because this is this hand is all just one piece of mesh. Next, it's going to automatically set up bones for the character. This might take a little time. Okay, and you'll just want to check for any odd deformities. It looks like to me this was a good rig. I don't see any odd uh, out of place deformities on the body. We'll hit next. And now we have a T-pose ready. Now, if you had an animation already selected, it would show up over here on the right side. You can X out of that so that we can go ahead and download the rigged model. So when you hit download, it'll just show you T-pose here. So we'll hit download. And what you'll want to do is now you can replace this with the model that comes with Smile here. So I'm going to replace it. All right. Now that that's replaced, I'm going to come in here and I'm going to delete the motion files. Now, you may want to know what all these motions do. Um, you know, just have these backed up somewhere. Um, I kind of re I remember these first three, so it's easy enough to remember those. And I'm going to now replace them. So I'm deleting them out of the motion folder. Once you've downloaded the new model from Mixamo, we'll re-import into Blender. And now we're going to apply the um, empties here to the hands of the model. So we'll do this. This is the hook left hand. So we'll need to also we want to change this to 60 right here, 60 frames per second. Okay, so on the left hand, we'll come down to this little orange box here. We're going to change the parent 
to armature and then we're going to choose bone and then we're going to choose left i typed an l in here so i can find left hand quickly so there we go went to the left hand same thing here we're going to choose armature bone and then this is the right hand so let's find the right hand right hand there we go all right and then i'm going to just move these closer to where the actual hands are um i found that sometimes i have to edit these empties and rotate them um i'll kind of like leave this part up to you guys if you see in battle that the swords or the shields or whatever are not in the right position then you'll need to rotate these so that they are um, and then just resave the file so now i'm going to export it again as an fbx just leave everything that's there and save over the file again i'm going to come back into mixamo and i'm going to find myself an idle animation so let's just choose this idle animation. That looks good enough. I might slow it down just a little bit to make it look a little more lengthy. Okay, so we got that. So let's do a download again. So this time with download, we're gonna choose without skin. We're gonna choose our frames per seconds as 60. And then we're gonna go ahead and download. Now, once that's downloaded, we're going to grab it and we're going to put it in our motion folder. I'm going to rename it motion 002 underscore weight. And then I'm going to transfer this into the time span and fix tool. This is what um, Smile has shared to fix uh, longer animations that are made in other programs. So um, we're going to need that for this. Um, so the first thing we'll do is go back to Blender. We don't need this one anymore, so just go ahead and hit New. I'm going to import that file, the new motion file, and just see how long the animation is. So you see all the uh, frames here. The last frame is the one that you want to tag. So our final frame is 143. So we'll go back to the folder and we're going to drag the new animation into the FBX settings and put in 143, hit enter, and it converts it. And that's all we had to do. Now I'm going to copy it back into our motion folder. So let's go back paste it there we go and we should be good to go so let's import our character into smile so i'm going to create a new game file just real quick so we're going to add the asset back in so it was already at the correct size when i exported it um, it was already at the 10th scale so i'm going to put that to one here and now i'm going to import it and then we should have our guy in there so there he is and that's all we had to do so if you have some animations you want to use from mixamo instead of the default ones you can do that now it will not work with the default um bone rig if you want to export to unity this is why we're starting from scratch but that is all